If you go into the NHS in this country with anxiety or any form of um, chronic mm, mental health issue, you're going to be sent for CBT, Cognitive Behavioural Therapy, because that's the the one that everybody believes is effective and it's the only one that's state supported. But when you're working with people who have deep-seated trauma, and I mean emotional trauma, I mean things that have happened in their lives that have left a scar uh, and still trouble them, um, CBT is not effective. It certainly will help them get an idea of what's happened and why, but it doesn't change the way they feel inside. And the therapy that I use uses the body instead of the cognitive part of the brain. It uses body sensation, which is linked directly to that part of the brain which controls the way you feel, which is your limbic system or emotional brain. And it's right in the middle of your brain. So it, it monitors what's going on in your body and it gives you a sense of safety or not in the world. And so some people who come to me have had a succession of things in their lives it's unbelievable how many things they've had from you know a difficult birth anxious parenting accidents um, sometimes they've been hospitalized uh, multiply they've had car accidents sometimes many of those all of these things leave an imprint in the limbic system a memory trace which then becomes easily triggered later in life if you then get a stressful job or relationship or you lose somebody that you love any of those things can be traumatic for a person so what what I do that's different is I talk to that part of the brain where the memory trace is and we go in and we use various methods like tapping um, eye movement desensitization and reprocessing which is using the finger movements to track the eyes across from left to right and that seems to just unpick the issue in a way that means that people are no longer affected by it and they, they're clear and they're free and the body resets itself.